fuck this van in particular, please. Thank you. Platinum mobile, that's fun. Is that... Hey, it's Spider-Man. Is he being ridden by actual Bayonetta? I don't know why I said actual, but like, this universe is Bayonetta. No time for minnows. Is Jean dead? But also, can I have those weapons, please? <laughs> I'm like, maybe this Bayonetta can die solely so that I can have the weapons, please? I do love this Bayonetta design. We've never seen, like, colorful hair. Oh no! Spider Boy! Never seen Bayonetta with colorful hair. And this is a really fun interpretation. Hey, this is a really fun interpretation. I like how conveniently off-screen is the thing she's swinging from, just like in the old Spider-Man 2 video game. <laughs> or no, in that one, you could see it. It was just a, a strange um, floating point. Um, oh, no! Uh, it was the Spider-Man for the PS1 slash PC. I actually played it on the PC. That was the one where it just shoots... Oh, I just get to Oh, I just get to play as this Bayonetta. Yeah, give me some info. This world's Bayonetta. From another world beyond Ginan Gagap, her experiences and environment have led to some differences, but she's still Bayonetta. While in masquerade form, continue walking on the walls to stick to them and crawl on them for time. Hold B after a jump to swing on a lava web. Double tap R while moving to shoot a web forward and zip to the end to use a mercy escape. Uh, sure, okay. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Okay, 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 okay. No, no, keep, keep going, keep going. Nope, I guess not. Why does, why does the spider climb have its limits? Why, why would it work like that? Okay, now we're back in it. I'm controlling a spider again, which you know I love. Nope, not that, I guess. There's... Okay, I was, I was misreading the... Signal, okay. I like that. I like that web zip line. Makes you this game really makes you feel like Spider Man. I think that counted as a dodge, but uh, didn't feel good about it. <laughs> Received a bewitchment, dodge all the incoming train cars! I'm so good at this game. I can't be stopped. So close. Is me. Oh, not that one. That's a fun. I, I'm glad I figured out the control for that because it's very fun. Oh, the, I gotta go faster than that. I guess I probably should just not even bother. Ooh. 
No, no, no. Okay, holding down. Okay, I guess you can just get crushed by building sometimes if you're too fast. So that taught me the wrong lesson. Okay. No, don't get close to it, because then you die. But if you stay... You really gotta decide. I can really feel like I'm supposed to be having fun right now. And that's... That sure is something, isn't it? I really... I, I didn't love ziplining onto the enemy that I couldn't even see, which then led directly to me dying. I didn't love that. Okay. Hey, look at that, we're having fun again. I just saw the time limit, actually. The witch hunts are over, guys. I can really tell that I'm supposed to be having fun here. It is... It is readily apparent that uh, I'm supposed to be having fun. Hey, when does that time limit even show up, actually? Because I sure didn't notice when it happened. Oh, oh, word? Oh, 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 now he's fine. Nope, no, he's not. I like how I'm saying he. Like, this is Bayonetta. It's not me summoning the spider. This just is Bayonetta in a spidery form. Um, I guess I just, I don't want to blame women for men's mistakes, and I am going to assume that the guy who designed this specific section was a man. So when did, hang on, I'm back to where I was before. When did the timer show up? I'm legitimately confused what that was. I'm, I... Wait, what was the timer? When did that even happen? Did they turn it off for my second life? What even... I don't... I don't know what that was. Okay. Okay. Couldn't see that until it exploded. I like the skating going on here. It's fun. I haven't brought it up yet, but it's a fun gimmick. I like it. Yep, yeah, really like that.
millions of Tokyo residents are dead, I, I guess. It's been like that for a while, but it just it just really had me like, oh yeah, this is another city that's being completely destroyed like we're in a Michael Bay movie. See, that timer I saw, and I knew I was being timed. I'm sure it had shown up beforehand last time, but then it didn't show up the second. I don't... I was... Baffling. Why does this... Why does this Bayonetta Spider get to talk? I love it, but it... Why... Oh, uh, it's a cool slingshot with the spider web. That's cool. Did that? That? What the hell was that? Artifacting. That's kind of cool. Iridescent core emergency interceptor unit. So it is cool to get this new Bayonetta design. For what you've done. Once I make my move, you're free to check the king. That's the that's the energy I got from that. Um. As Bayonetta fights, your soul and the demon souls resonate, creating special energy. With full energy, press the sticks in to unleash a savage, wide-ranging demon masquerade attack. I gotta build energy. I figured it was, that's di it, it seems different from Magical Essence. Because I've been at full on that for a while. Well, that just kind of happens, huh? I didn't even see it because of the camera. Tactical energy, I sure am attacking. I feel like a lot. Oh, it's that it's the thing right below my health bar, I think is what it is. I'm like a little over halfway there, it looks like. Does Bayonetta have the same lollipops as I do? Because I'll take one if I need to. Yeah. Why am I over here now? Trying to blow me out. I couldn't tell that camera angle was just from my placement in the arena or because it was a thing I was just trying to bring my attention towards. I, I don't. I, I guess I'm being super savage. 
I, I broke the iridescent core once. I think I really missed a chance there, honestly. Sure. I, did, I, I feel like I did something kind of wrong there, but I got it. That's what matters. Yeah, now you get to do the Super Mario 64. Oh, I should have guessed. Oh, it really did not like me waggling it. I not waggling. I was spinning it, and I tried both directions, and and uh, it sure didn't like what I chose to do there. Okay, so I started a thought earlier, and now I'm gonna finish it. It's the implication that uh, uh, our OG Bayonetta being here just didn't matter at all. I mean, I guess she's here so that she can collect that precious, precious chaos gear. But aside from that. Um, she didn't really participate in that, she was just kind of wandering the whale around until this pain edit won. Great, yeah. Didn't didn't feel good about that one. I understand. <laughs> I'm glad God, are you si and now this one's gonna die? I love it when she defeats, like, the biggest, baddest, most arch Eve. What the hell? Just completely wiping... I didn't wipe before that got bronze medal, but, like, did a very good job destroying, like, the most powerful uh, creature in the whole world. And then instantly she just gets killed by three smaller and presumably much less powerful things. How did this bayonet even know that one was here? Did she just throw him away? Okay. Rest in peace. I hope we get the spider at least. I'll take it from here. Yeah, I couldn't really understand exactly the deal with these things are, but they seemed fun. Seemed a little chonkier than the guns, but not nearly as slow as the club. That's fine. I didn't even get to do any of that because I didn't know any of the combos, but that looks fun. Yeah, she did it super easy. It's almost like the, the, the purple air bayonet should have be been able to do that. Swear it. And so will Sean. Th like this Jean, I assume? Just tell me about the Chaos Gears, that's all I want to know. Oh no, the Arch Iridescent Giga Behemoth Decisive Unit. Are we gonna fight it now? No, the, the, it very clearly said that wasn't singularity, but okay. Otherwise, it would have said singularity unit. She just rip her own heart out? What does that accomplish? It's metal as hell, but why why would that help? Couldn't you just like bite your thumb to bleed a little bit? Oh, 
Oh, now we're like legit Godzilla. Now it's not even. Now they're not even trying to hide it. Shin Gamora. I almost said Shin Gamora. <laughs> Font of destruction. Gamora minus one. They're not even trying! Let's fucking go! I love this. Even the music is very clearly meant to sound like the Godzilla theme. To face off against a giant homunculus, Bane offers up her own heart to summon Gamora with its full power unleashed. Block the enemy slams, bite when it blocks, and slam when it tries to grapple. Counter effectively to win! Okay. Block the slam, bite when it blocks, slam to grab when it tries to grapple. That was a slam. Let's try shoot. That's a good trick. I, I pressed bite when I tried to grapple. That's what I'm supposed to do, right? I like the concept behind this, and I know they're giant behemoths. It's pretty slow. Is it worth trying to get a hit in, or should I literally just wait? Okay, you, I can get a hit in. Oh, it shot me before I could shoot it. Strike! Oh, there's like... Oh, I thought it was going to rip the building open, but no, this is just a separate thing. Having the building in the foreground made me think he was just going to, like, rip out a thing and... Slap him! Slap him! Yeah! That didn't do a ton, but it was, it was cool. Well, now that he's far away, I suppose I should. <clears throat> Are we going to... Is that... Yeah? Shoot. Shoot him! No, stop it. Yeah, those counters do a lot. Yeah. Hit the arch iridescent with Syngamora's flame three times. I don't know why that was a special move, but I did it because I'm so cool. God, that's so fucking Godzilla. It's even like specifically Shin Godzilla <laughs> with the jaws opening up like that. Okay, that's a little different. That's that's a dark. That's a, 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 a Bloodborne vibe. Now, the question, as always, whenever Bayonetta does something cool like this, the question remains, why doesn't she just always do this? I'll take that. That was a lot of fun. It was slightly slow. I think it could, be, it could just sped up by about 20%. Um, but that's a lot of fun. I know she ripped her own heart out, but... Like, she would have done it if she didn't think she was going to live. So if she can survive it, like, what, what, what's the consequence for that? I, ripping your heart out for a centuries-old witch, I don't know. What's, what's the, what's the play here, Bayonetta? Like, she, she's fine now.
by Bayonetta Origins coming to Switch this already. I actually do want to play it, but... The Chaos Gear. Are we going to get a fun dance sequence? The music makes it sound like it. Or is it just a, a Zelda item? Just a Zelda item, a fun little musical motif. I'm not much for waiting patiently. And I suppose that girl isn't either. Billions are dead, Bayonetta. Why, why are you even trying to look sketchy? It's just fucking Luca. It's just Luca. And of course he fucking gave me Luca. You had to shove his this face in. Just one outcome, hey, Lu Luca, I'm begging you to shut the fuck up. <sighs> Chaos gears. Okay, and that's fine. Here, the the pro hey we got the Ignis RNA yo yo and now we have the 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 spider guy for real massive web a tractor and slingshot rush and I assume this will let us um, move like the other bayonetta which is good I I don't like having an obstacle course that requires me to use her movements um, in perfect succinctness. But I did still like the gimmick. Oh, Walk the Dog. That's a fun name for your yo-yo weapon. Alright, that's cool. Okay. We should take care of some house business while we can. The accessory mallet of rewards? The hell is that? Um, and Super Mirror Beta 1. Um... I mean, let's do a little bit of shopping. Here's, this is some warehouse business. Let's get down to business. Oh, Violet and John are just here. Uh, Violet, Viola uh, is just here as well. Um, got any more of them red hot shots? Oh, you do. That being said. Okay, you're still sold out of those. And yeah, I should probably get a moon pearl while we can. Be smart to blow up on magic or whatever, since it's apparently important for using your stand. And I'm curious what the mallet does. Increase orbs from using torture attacks? Nah. Thank you. I wish I could read all the lore, because that was... M that was a side chapter? Does this have Viola in it? Is that what the gimmick is? I was hoping to get to read through all the lore and extra stuff we had this time around, so we didn't have to start with that next session, but I guess I have to enter into a level to do that. And I don't want to start the Crimson Shadow right away, and it's also getting pretty late. So I guess we'll just, we'll just start off with the massive mood killer and momentum killer. I, hey, can't be a momentum killer if it's at the beginning of a session so there's no momentum We're already, right? That's fine. Where's the lantern I bought with my money? For you, Viola. It was Bayonetta's money and I bought this for you. Yeah, awesome. Cool. All right. Um, I'm enjoying it. I'm not hating it. Um, I can definitely already feel some of the the things behind um, why people didn't love this game. Um, I'm I'm baffled. Oh, these are selfies of her going to fun places. That's I hope those expand as she visits other worlds. I hope that's what's going on there. Um, I'm, I'm baffled at the idea of only one weapon at a time, since that was kind of a staple of the whole um, game before, the, the whole the franchise before this one. Um, but I like this, the stand thing um, of using your demons in combat. Um, that Godzilla fight was really, really fun. Um, 
Uh, so, yeah, I'm liking it. I, I already like viola more than I expected to, which is not a ton. I was, I, I think I, I've heard online that a lot of people were really annoyed by viola, and so I was, like, prepared to really not dig her vibes. And she's fine. I'm liking her. She's, she's good. Um, it's a little weird that, like, she just... She, she escaped from a world that just got genocided and she was really serious and then next cutscene she's goofing off a little bit but I expected her to be like really serious I gotta prove myself the entire time and the idea that like she does have a little bit of a silly streak I'm excited to see more of that I think that's a really fun idea um um cons Luca And then a bunch of nitpicks that I guess I can go into as well. Um, the the feel of it just feels a little bit off compared to Bayonetta 2, particularly. It's not terrible, and I like I understand that you want to feel a little bit different with every game, but it just I don't know. There's just bits and pieces that feel a little bit unpolished, and a lot of the you know a lot of the special levels. It's like. It doesn't really give you a chance to figure out what you're doing before you're just thrown into the action and you feel bad at it. Like, you just feel like you're not doing a good job. Um, which, that's very much not the point of this game. The point of this game is that you feel badass and cool the whole time. And this game is not... This game does not do a great job of achieving that. Of, hey, you're kicking ass, you're doing a really cool thing. Um, and then, story-wise, I'm not hating it yet. It's fine. It's good. You know, it, it's... Bayonetta has always been more style over substance, and I don't think anyone would take offense to that. Um, but, um, yeah. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. That's where I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling we'll see. Um, but uh, that is where we're going to call it for tonight. Good night, everybody.